breaking news as we come to you on Fox Local for Fox 6 News at 6. A Milwaukee man shot and killed by an Ohio police officer on day two of the RNC. Outrage and emotions running high from community members. They're demanding answers and they want them now. That is where we begin tonight at 6. A man is shot and killed by an officer from Columbus, Ohio. And family members confirmed to us tonight the victim's name is Samuel Sharp. This happened this afternoon near 14th and Belize, and we've just gotten surveillance video in of the incident. We're going to warn you, of course that this may be disturbing as we play it for you. I'm going to walk you through this video right now. I want you to watch on the left-hand side of your screen. You see what looks like two people walking into the street here. Then you see what seems to be police officers behind them. Now, this is where we're going to freeze the video where the shots were allegedly fired. Again, this happened near 14th and Belite, and that's where we find our Stephanie Quirk tonight. And Steph, you've learned a lot in the last hour. Tell us what you've learned. Yeah, well, we've actually just learned the press conference we've been awaiting for here at 17th and Valite is going to be held in about 30 minutes at 630. We will be learning more from Milwaukee police. I'm going to step out of the way here. As you can see, uh, this area is still very blocked off. Again, we're near King Park uh, in 17th and Valite, the corner of uh, 17th and Valite and about three blocks uh, south. It's also all taped off. Off. Um, we've learned from the street angels and family members uh, the man shot was homeless and lived in this neighborhood. His name is Samuel Sharp and he is in his 40s. We've also learned Milwaukee police are handling the investigation and the U.S. Secret Service is playing some role uh, in the investigation. Over the past uh, few hours that we've been here, this uh, the police presence at the scene has died down a bit, but it's still taped off. Uh, many, many, many officers here and we saw multiple, at least a dozen unmarked uh, squad cars coming in and out of the scene here. Community members and family members of the man shot actually held a press conference uh, about an hour ago. Take a listen. His mom has to go through this, his sisters, his nieces and nephews, his cousins. This is not right. Now again, the press conference with Milwaukee police will begin at 6.30. We'll learn more updates then and keep you posted on air and online. Reporting in Milwaukee, Stephanie Quirk, Fox 6 News. We'll of course try to take uh, that to air and of course we'll have it streaming on our website as well as on Fox Local and again, hoping to learn more there. Stephanie Quirk, nice job today, thanks.